So now that we've got a lot of the mainstream positions out of the way, wide receiver, linebacker, cornerback, ETC, it's time to get into the meme positions, fellas. I want to try something a little bit different today, and I don't think that we've done it before. But what is going on, fellas? Generic Jacket 7 here, back with another X Factor 99 career. Today, we're going to be doing fullback. When is the first fullback even going to be taken? None of them are going to be taken, in fact. I guess we'll just go with Adric Benson out of Kansas State. He's not bad. 68 overall in the undrafted section. These fullbacks are unappreciated. First off, we got to go ahead and make him 69. I would not have a clue what X Factor this guy could get. I don't even know if fullbacks can get X Factors. I mean, obviously they can, but I wonder if Madden is just going to give him traditional running back ones or something like that. An elite fullback would have 37 short accuracy. <laughs> Another interesting thing to find out as we check his top three skills, A+, plus, impact, run and pass. I wonder where he's going to get taken because he's projected undrafted. I don't know if he's going to go late six, early seventh. Let's just skip the draft and go right to the review. Our boy was taken round seven, pick 13. Here's a member of... The New York Giants! Okay, that's the second time we've pulled the Giants. Wait, what? I can't even be a fullback? That just made this so much more complicated. So what this essentially means is we can't follow his career alongside him. We have to now be Pat. So I'm still going to go ahead, simulate 10 years, do the five years after. I promise you I'll do my best to try and follow his career exactly how it is. But uh, he could retire at any point. I have no idea. So as you can see, hidden development. We don't know what his X factors are yet. Let's go ahead and start Daniel Jones as well. Let's go simulate these 10 years. All right, we finally are here in the 2030 season. The team has turned around a lot. Look at that. Our fullback has 21 skill points. What X factor does he have though? Wait, what? Ah, okay. So fullbacks just, they're not real people, guys. You heard it here first. Madden does not want... Adrian Benson having any X factors. So he has rushed the ball a lot of times and he scored a lot of touchdowns. 29 in 2024, 24 in 2028. He's averaging nearly over 100 yards a game. So they're utilizing him just like a running back alongside Saquon Barkley. Average yards per carry has to be the best in NFL history, even though he does play fullback. He's had 10 Pro Bowl appearances, was the league leader in rushing once. He was the 2021 MVP, two-time, three-time, four-time, five-time, six, six, six-time most valuable player, Adric Benson, my guy. Pat Schumer has got a lot of XP. Look at this team though. We have a 94 overall right guard who's a superstar. He was taken in the same class as us. The defense looks kind of trash. No stars there. They're kind of just holding it together. Saquon has fallen off 87 overall. Their quarterback is 65. I mean, as you can imagine, Benson is head and shoulders above everybody else. All the other players here are created anyway. No real fullbacks. We have a 27,000 legacy score, four Super Bowls, 32 yearly awards. I mean, we've got to at least set him as a captain, right? He's definitely earned it. I guess we'll go year by year and see what we can kind of make of these stats. Still here? I mean, Saquon retired. This is 12 years in, keep in mind, so three more to go. Still 99 overall, still has not lost a step, still the best fullback in NFL history, probably the best running back in NFL history as well. And this is without an ability slot. Imagine if we had that, we'd be so much better. I have this weird feeling that they're using this guy as a running back. Even though he is the number one fullback on the depth chart, look at the running back. You cannot tell me that they are not starting Benson at running back, bro. Absolutely no way. That's why I think his yards are so gassed up, which is a shame because I wanted to see how he would do as a fullback. Like, do we have blocking stats? Like, what's the go? So 15 years in, Adric Benson has 22,714 rushing yards. We average 8.3 yards per carry, which is crazy. 309 touchdowns, 751 broken tackles. Like our running back, he's fumbled the ball zero times, has a longest run of his career of 95 yards. And even though there's no way to tell if he's been playing fullback or not, looking at the stats, I can tell you that he has allowed zero sacks in his entire career. 
Now I know what you guys are probably thinking, why don't you just go ahead and simulate year by year and then add those stats on? I would have to stop in the Super Bowl week, record all of the stats again, and if I miss that for one year and this guy retires, because Madden is programmed the way it is, we will have no idea at all what his stats are. We'll go look at the NFL records and then we'll simulate year by year and see just how long this fullback stays in the NFL. So in 15 years, we have the most rushing yards of all time. Zeke in second, Gurley in third. We won rushing touchdowns in a landslide, 309 to 169. We're still not done yet. Fun fact, we are not on the rushing yards in a season, so maybe we did play fullback. We do, however, have the most touchdowns in a single season with 29. We also had 25 in 2032, 24 in 2028, and 22 in 2030. In a game, I don't think we were anywhere close. We weren't. And as for rushing touchdowns, did we score more than five? I can confirm, no, we did not. I guess we'll go find out how many seasons this guy's gonna play now. This is the last time I'll update the legacy score. Nearly 35,000, five Super Bowls, 46 yearly awards. I mean, just the fact that this guy was even a one-time MVP says a lot. But a six-time, maybe even seven-time? Wait, he's gone. This is after his 17th season. Yeah, he retired. He's not here anymore. I thought he would have played until he was maybe 38, 39. He was still a 99, 17 years in. I mean, that's how these careers go. They're really strange. A lot of weird stuff happens, but we can safely say that we got his stats. He did amazingly good at a fullback and he retired after 17 seasons. But that being said, fellas, that's gonna wrap up this episode of a 99 overall career. If there's any other positions you wanna know that I haven't done, because I've done a lot, right? Look at, look at the other videos. If you made it this far into the video, you are the real MVP. I hope the rest of your day is awesome. And from me personally, I'm out. Peace.